began his career as a writer and animator on Sesame Street, where he garnered six Emmy Awards, going on to create several animated projects for Cartoon Network and Nickelodeon. His number one New York Times bestselling books have been recognized with many awards around the world. And now it's time to let your imagination run wild with beloved children's book author, Mo Willems. Hey there. Hi, hi, how are you? Good to be here. Well, over 60 children's books under your belt, so popular with children, with iconic characters. Again, such a treat to talk to you as a parent. But tell us all about this first for you, the first live action special that is for kids, but also for adults, right? Oh, it's for adults. This is a grown up show. That's why we have celebrities. It's a big fancy performance with Anthony Anderson and Rachel Dratch and Tony Hale and a whole big cast of celebrities where we read my books, we perform, we uh, sing songs, we draw. And the idea is to get you the grownups to see your favorite celebrities being ridiculous so that you will get a shameectomy. <laughs> And I think that's something that a lot of folks need to remember is to just be silly at times, right? <laughs> Absolutely. It's a form of connection. What I really am interested in is what do you do after the special? Do you read to your kids differently? Do you perform with them? Do you start drawing with them? I want to be the spark to you having a better sense of communication and connection in your family. What's it like for you to see your, you know, your books come to life? It's a little terrifying, frankly. Uh, I was so lucky to have such a talented cast and such a generous cast and to have such a talented crew and a generous crew that they accepted me as one of their own. So I just went up and I did it. Um, and the magic for me was looking out into the audience and seeing the kids really digging it. That was an incredible experience. Now you started in stand-up and sketch comedy. Did you know what you wanted to be as a kid? I knew I wanted to be funny and draw in some way. I loved Peanuts, the comic strip. When I was five years old, I wrote Charles Schultz a letter. It said, Dear Mr. Schultz, may I have your job when you're dead? Oh my goodness, that's so cool. And of course, you're an animator. Do you have any doodling tips for us big kids? Yes, well, the first thing is, there's no such thing as a wrong doodle. A doodle is an exploration. A doodle is the line telling you where it wants to go. So don't be embarrassed. Don't say, I don't know how to draw. In fact, get caught drawing. If your kid comes in the room and says, hey, I want a sandwich, say, not now, I'm drawing. And suddenly your kid will want to draw with you because then drawing is cool. I was going to say, I've got a pen and a paper here right now, and I have started doodling as you were talking. Right. And I just started with, I know you can't see it, but it's like a city, cityscape, right. you know? So there is no wrong way to doodle, right? Right. <laughs> you know, here's... There's no wrong way to doodle, and it's not just you expressing yourself, it's you discovering yourself. So my notebooks, my work notebooks, you can see me, let me just see. 90% of my work notebooks are just drawings, just doodles. Look at That's that! That's what I do. <laughs> oh, tell us when folks can catch the special. The special is running on HBO Max right now. Not only see the special, but 15 of my animated cartoons based on my books are also on HBO Max right now. Mo Willems, thank you so much for your time. Remember, yeah. the Storytime All-Stars present Don't Let the Pigeon Do Storytime is streaming on HBO Max right now. Thank you again, Mo.